What's up, YouTube Nation? We're back, and uh, we got a storm coming, massive storm coming. Literally, it's probably an hour away. Check it out. You can see it there on the horizon. And so we've got the spawn, and we have a storm coming. And we're gonna see if these fish are lighting up. We might fish shallow. I think we're gonna definitely start with some piles because we know they're there. Uh, but we've had this warm up. Now we've got some warm water coming. I'm gonna guess there's some that are up shallow too. So we're gonna do that as well. Sickness is getting in the water. We've got the king's tails. Check these out, guys. They're all lined up, baby. And I love it for casting now. And I uh, got the hammer 10, ready to rock and roll. Here we go, let's do it. All right, as we start to go out to our spot today, a uh, couple things. One thing is we've got the new, the uh, Rin Lake tournament coming up for crappie masters. We're looking forward to that. That's gonna be awesome. Me and Mike are gonna try extra hard during that tournament. Um, what else do we got going on? Ah, it's just, I'll tell you what, guide trips have been crushing it lately. So if you're interested, certainly give me a holler on the guide trips. Um, very excited to have the Hammer 10 and the King's Tail. Um, in stock and we have a limited amount of those 200 series reels left so if you're interested in those again everything available everything you're going to see is at threepoundfishing.com we will be fishing with the comet from sniping braid and uh yeah let's do this now that's a good starting pile now we got the wind really starting to pop up so i'm hoping I'm pretty sure that we're gonna get this episode in, but look at look at this pile of fish right there, guys. You know they're gonna be on fire. So I've gone back to the white hair jig. It is on fire. The uh, combo pack on the website, yeah, go get it. Check out this guy, he can't help himself. Bam, first drop, guys. I'm telling you, try that combo pack B. Look at that, slab, one drop. Check that out guys, great fish. Letting them go, putting some fish in the boat real quick before the storm, the storm and the spawn. We'll just call that the uh, S is squared, baby. And again, I'm going back to these hair jigs on my website. Um, I was playing with plastics for a while, but I gotta admit, these things are on fire and it really doesn't matter what color you take, to be honest with you, but check them out. They're so priced correctly. Um, and here we're just getting a play. See if we get some action here. Now these fish are deep. And uh, because they're deep, I sometimes can just, we'll just go straight on top. Of them. I have the rule of nine feet. Nine feet, any fish below nine feet, I can get right on top of it, which is being, I'm showing you right here. Just gonna go ahead and sit right on top of them. And if there's if it's a slow bite i'm just gonna sit it there and wait for the thump and there it was and that's just a vertical presentation guys good eating size fish here right there fantastic that's what i'm talking about now that's hair jig and this is the hammer 10 going down we're using the of course like i said the comet we're gonna vertical jig again if i don't feel that those fish are moving a lot I can get right on top of them. And again, it's the rule of nine feet that I use. And I can just sit it there and you can see them come after it. And see if anybody's gonna close the deal for us here. We just got hit there and we missed that. I put my fingers on the braid, gives me all the, all the feel I need. Cause sometimes these fish are really finicky, especially on my home lake. and they can't help themselves. They're pulling themselves, constantly pulling themselves off that pile. And you can give it a jig here and there, see if that sparks it. And we got them. We got the big fish, guys. And this storm is coming in. This is a slab, guys. Super slab right there. Wow. All right, guys, that's a fantastic fish, man. This is a tournament fish just doing the vertical jigging. Is that not fantastic? That's so awesome. We're gonna keep him for pictures for later. 
Now, again, we got a storm coming. It's getting extremely dark. Wind has picked up drastically. The water temperature has dropped. We're sitting at roughly around 66 degrees, um, far away from my uh, the source of energy on this lake. But um, so I think it's going to be dynamic. We've got a the biometric pressure that's dropping drastically. Uh, we've got a spawn that's going on. We've got warming water temperatures just near the spawn, and it doesn't get any better. Now, I'm a big believer right now in the the hair jigs. Okay, so check out all the hair jigs on the website. Now. I have been using during the spawn all the three pound fishing jigs, okay? Everything you can imagine, but I'm really favoring the orange. The orange has been on fire right there. And what makes the three pound fishing jig special is that bait keeper on the back side and the perfect eye lit. No doubt about it. When you deal with these micro braids, super important that you have a perfect eye lit because it'll slip right through, right? So there you go. Um, yeah. What else can I say? Let's catch some fish. All right. So look at those. We even have more fish over here. This is ridiculous. Guys, and you know they're going to be active. You know they're going to be active. So we just got to... Guys, this is crazy. You know these guys are going to be chomping on this. So again, I'll start off far away from the from the pile, roughly around 10, 15 feet, especially when they're this deep. I don't have to stay that far off. Um, dropping down there with my split shot and split shot in the uh, hair jig right there. And these guys are gonna hit this like a, uh, probably like bread in an aquarium, I'm assuming. Boom! That's that drag of that 200 series reel, guys. Freaking awesome. And we got ourselves an eater fish boom good fish guys this is great i don't know man maybe it needs to store more often we the one thing that we have definitely lacked this spawn or this spring so far is storms we have not had any significant rainfall which i'm not asking for it necessarily but i gotta tell you i do think that look at i'm gonna go straight on this i do think when you get nice warm rains it really helps um fuel the spawn i really do so, boom, that was easy. Hope you guys saw that not clear as day, because I'll tell you what, we could just lay it down today. This is crazy good. How many fish is that? Now, we haven't even gone up shallow yet. We're letting them go. Great fish. See, now here's a pile right here that is, you know, right there at that 10 foot mark. So the last thing I'm gonna do is get on top of this pile until the very end. But reality is I probably never would. So it's the rule of nine, but at the same time, I'm mo more times than not, unless it's really deep, I'm not getting on top of it. Um, if I want to really hold, you know, catch fish, if um, I'm willing to risk it, then of course it's doable. Boom, and we just caught a fish. Good fish too. So there you go. We're catching fish all the time. This is the 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 S squared is without a doubt, guys, legit. Storm and spawn. Put them together, you're gonna catch them. There we go. Another fish. All right. <laughs> Straight on top, guys. The rule of nine feet. Huge deal for crappie fishing. We got the storm rolling. We got the spawn rolling. We got fish on brush piles. We got fish up shallow. Although, I gotta tell you, I think we're just gonna be sticking with the uh, deep stuff today. We've got this storm getting awful close now. I never, uh, you know, I believe in safety first, 100%. So, I've got a little lightning indicator on the Bass Cat, which you guys may or may not know about, but um, they actually come equipped for it. All right, guys, well, that's gonna end it. Let me just uh, walk through a couple things for you. Um, one is the king's tail the king's tail has been doing incredible eight footer for your spawning needs check that out it's a hot hot rod right now again the hammer 10 is now available back in stock absolutely a stunner of a rod check it out and it is back in stock as well um, or it is back in stock the hammer the, the king's tail is brand new 
So having a great time this spawn. Check it out. Check out the three pound fishing guide service. And uh, don't forget the rule of nine feet. Take it easy, guys.